The winners of the third communication award are Jacques Sirwa, Chris Garrett, Community Association of Oak Bay, the Kiwanis Club of Oak Bay, Victoria Natural History Society, Nature Canada, and Chris Edley for the tribute to J. Fenwick Lansdowne interpretive signage. This striking signage installed at Queen's Park in Oak Bay illustrates and narrates important stories of the artistic and natural heritage of our community. It celebrates artistic heritage in the life and art of Fenwick Lansdowne, world famous bird artist and longtime resident of Oak Bay, as well as natural history and the remarkable local bird life that inspired him and the beautiful Salish Sea shoreline where he discovered and studied many of the birds he painted and where they may be appreciated by visitors today. In all, it promotes awareness, appreciation, preservation and protection of this heritage. Early in 2019, Jacques Sirwa and Chris Garrett shared a wish to create some form of public recognition of Lansdowne's work in the Oak Bay community, where he lived and painted most of his life until his death in 2008, and where his family still reside. They approached the Community Association of Oak Bay seeking support for their idea. The association then invited local artist and art historian Robert Amos to present an illustrated lecture on the life and work of Lansdowne, whom Robert had included in his book, Artists in Their Studios, Where Art is Born, 2007. The Community Association gladly took on sponsorship and promotion of the project. With initial funding from Nature Canada, Chris Edley of Edley Signs was engaged to design the signage for the tribute. Visits to possible sites on the Oak Bay shoreline led to the selection of Queen's Park as the optimal choice. An initial concept illustration was developed and presented to interested local groups, including the Oak Bay Heritage Foundation and the Kiwanis Club of Oak Bay. The latter provided a generous grant in support of the project followed by similar generous funding from the Victoria Natural History Society. In September 2020, Oak Bay Council was presented with the final design images for the tribute signage and approved its installation at Queen's Park. It was installed in March 2021. J. Fenwick Lansdowne was born in Hong Kong in 1937, the only son of British parents. When he was three years old, he moved with his family to Victoria. His interest in birds began around the age of five and by 13, he was painting them. He was inspired by regular outings to view local birds in their natural settings, including Oak Bay Shores. His cottage studio where he painted since 1963 still stands at 941 Victoria Avenue. It was placed on the Oak Bay Heritage Register in 2008. The tribute signage display comprises three individual panels, one vertically oriented and two horizontal. Together, they present the intended stories of the artist, his work, and the nature that may be seen and appreciated at the site. The signs are fabricated in black powder coated aluminum with a pale blue background on the panels to harmonize with the marine background. The three panels are ornamented with whimsical elements of silhouette cutouts of the birds depicted on the sign panels or frequently seen from this vantage point. A kingfisher, black oyster catchers, and brant geese. The vertical panel is about the artist himself. It presents a short biographical note in English and French and is illustrated with a drawing of the artist by Eric Zenas, a photo by Robert Amos of the artist at work in his studio, a photo of the exterior of the artist's former cottage studio, and a series of study sketches by the artist for his painting of bubbleheads, which is included in another panel. It also includes a short quote from the artist about his inspiration to paint birds, and another from nature artist Robert Gann about their childhood birding forays to local spots. The final element on the panel is a testimonial from His Royal Highness Prince Philip. The first of the horizontal panels includes three images of Lansdowne painting of birds commonly seen at this site. Black oyster catchers, 
buffle heads, and the great blue heron, with their common names in English and French, and their scientific names. Each bird painting is accompanied by a short excerpt from Lansdowne's own text in Birds of the West Coast. The second horizontal panel includes images of Lansdowne paintings of the marbled burlet and brant geese, the former usually further offshore but sometimes seen here, and the latter once abundant here but now uncommon. The story of the reduced brant population relates to the final element on this panel, a map of the Victoria Harbour Migratory Bird Sanctuary. The 1923 creation of that federal sanctuary, which includes all 17.5 kilometres of Oak Bay's shoreline, was a response to declining migratory bird populations exemplified by commercial hunting of the brant. The accompanying text notes the need for continued protection of these birds from current threats and that this site is a perfect spot to connect with nature in the city. This is one of Oak Bay's most popular shoreline parks and presents a unique vantage point for appreciating the beautiful nature of the Salish Sea shore and its abundant and varied bird life. It was later learned that this was one of Lansdowne's favorite birding spots, which he often visited with his children to see the ducks. For this amazing tribute to a local artist, the Hallmark Heritage Society is pleased to present the winners with the Communication Award.